London is expensive. Being a young adult in London trying to socialise is, you guessed it, expensive. £5 for a pint is a joke. So we wanted to see if we could spend an entire day drinking in London completely for free. So buckle yourselves in, ladies and gents, for this extremely moist episode of... The Zack and they were watching yeah, face, I was watching yeah. Akira yeah. 90s kid, 2000s era 12 years old, DC shoe wearer No sign in, I just sang era Hungry, come like so in gear Cloudy, Michael Cera Mama, I've been boozing all day <laughs> We realised for this to be an impressive feat, we'd actually have to show a good variety of places where this is possible. So, we scoured the internet for a range of apps, business, networking events, film premieres, politics events happening that day. And guess what? A majority of them provide free drinks. So on with a phone full of new apps and having signed up to a handful of events, we headed out to see if we could spend an entire day in this beautiful city drinking for free. Alright, lads, so the other day I was chilling with this oh, bird in the pub, yeah. yeah. She was all asking me all types of questions like, where you from? Yeah, yeah, she was alright, fit less, but yeah, too many questions. Like, so like, too too many, many questions, mate. So, what's your name? I go by F can taste my crew, be fucking up the game so you can call me Triple A. Hope you enjoy this, because it's the most sober we're gonna be. How excited are you? <laughs> this is your little idea. The thing is, I'm trying not to smile as well. <laughs> I always do this, I get very excited at the beginning. I'm gonna have a few, I just quieting down as I go out. <laughs> it's with my team, swage for the numbers by a legendary king. Oh, for real? You know what's gonna get us? It's gonna be like the different mix of drinks that oh, we yeah. just end up having to drink because they're all free. Right, sobriety test. Down this line, my friends. Oh, he's sober! <laughs> Sobriety, completed it mate. 10 out of 10. We're approaching the first venue. We're starting off classy today. Sign up to their newsletter, you get a free pineapple daiquiri cocktail. Nervous. Cocktail numero uno. Oh, am I right in thinking you get a uh, free cocktail for signing up to um, win if you eat with us? Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah. okay, cool. What? Great news. No. When you dine with us. No. I'm gonna eat with them. Menu number one. Failure. Yeah. Attempt number two for drink number one. All bar one, let's have it. So with these guys, you sign up to the app and they very kindly offer you a free drink. Hi mate, I've got the app for a well drink. Um, yeah. Pop number two, drink number one. Pop the cheese, please. On with a challenge. On with a challenge. Mm. Where we're too much. More beer, more beer. Right, so the other camera died, but we're heading to some swanky wine tasting event. Trade tasting German wines from the 2018 vintage. For wine importers and big restaurants and shit. Visceral thrill a minute ride with some of the finest horse lessie. We're in a very posh end of London. And we're seeing Belgium. Powerful yet nuanced dry wine. And we have no idea about wines, literally no idea. Uh, so this one's going to be interesting. The game plan is to say that we are setting up a wine tasting channel. Right, so we've just got into... There's a barber. This is a very, very, very posh place. Pencils here, the tasting glasses I've set. 735 quid for six. Can make you fall to test. Now, when you sip the wine, you don't want to hold it by the actual wine itself because that will heat the temperature up to an undesired temperature. You want to swirl it, you want to smell it, and you want to see how the alcohol runs down through the viscosity of it. So, this is a fruity wine, it's obviously basking in the sun. 
First impressions. Delicious. I think today I'm after a bit more of a richer taste. What are we doing here, man? <laughs> oh, this is meant we can get fucked up. Oh, wow. <laughs> So it got to a point where we were literally waffling shit about German wines that we didn't understand. Listen to the level of waffle that is going on here. Natural. Was it sugar in the grape? Yeah. Later. Mm. Yeah. And therefore richer than the Cabernet that you had before. So on this one, you probably have. I don't know, probably around 30, <laughs> yeah. 35 maybe residual sugar. I mean, it doesn't mean much to people if they don't. That sounds like a lot, but yeah. with the acidity, it balances out. <laughs> yeah. We've just got invited to another event um, next Wednesday. We're in the circle, in the inner circle. How much more wine do you drink? Uh, eight more tables. <laughs> Beginning. Mm. Nice. Absolutely stupendous, dude. Absolutely stupendous. How are you feeling? Fucking licked. I want my 25th wine glass. <laughs> and I want my 26th. Pretty good wine tasting. Don't think we'll be buying anything. I think we'll let off now. Which bin do we throw up in? Oh, right. no, I'm not really kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Leave. <laughs> Cheers. Wow, feels like a different day. Almost three hours of wine tasting. How are you feeling, Jay? This is how actually pissed I actually am. I'm not even joking. I just got on my bike clock to get on a fucking Boris bike. <laughs> Literally, I just got my keys out to get a Boris bike. <laughs> The waffling is just going to increase as the day goes on. Yeah, yeah. five in the pot. Epic Co uh, Compilation. Enter. Army comes everywhere I go. I can't run with my enemy's show. Walk in the club with all of my thugs. What he's done, everybody go home. Yeah, Walk in the girl, them you lost me. Walk in the club with the girl, say hey. Yeah, nice, bro. Nice, yeah. Now we're going There's no champagne, we don't drink. What an idiot, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loser. Right, we're on venue number three, drink number. No, it's venue number four. Venue number four, drink number. 54. Multiple, 54. For app, apparently, we'll give it a whack. You're not real. Anyway, we've got, uh, we've got the dust gap. Is that, is that what you need? Yeah. Yeah. So we were fresh out of a swanky members only club and straight back to reality using the Dusk app for free vodka and rum. We used this time to look at business networking events and found a software developers meetup in Lego HQ. Now we have no idea on how to develop software but we are the kings of waffles so I'm sure we'd be fine. Right, so we just got done at Meat Liquor. Uh, we're heading to another bar in Soho for a free G&T, then the business networking events start. Oh wow, a giraffe and a pigeon showed up to remind you to like this video. Yeah, boy. Place number four, drink number god knows what. Here for a free, what are we for? Drink and tonic, yeah baby. I got that. So that one is on the Embargo app. They have loads of bars around London. This one was the closest. Free g and Happy days. Disgusting! We've hit a wall. The free drinks aren't fun anymore. For all them fine wines, it's free G and tonic. It's horrible. We're off. Alright, this is about half five. 
rush hour is real. We're heading to the Lego building for a software developers thing. Ooh. You're now tuned into the live set in the world, baby. People's FFM, baby. Leave your arms and guns and bring the fun. No waiting. Let's get everybody moving and shaking. It's DJ. Right, people, we are at location number five for drink number. How many we on? A lot. Yeah, we're on a few drinks now. Lego's HQ. Let's see what Lego's HQ is saying, because I'm very intrigued. Name isn't on the list, Jamie's is. I've got to wait. With the sun kiss glow, looking scrumptious girl like butter and melt. Skin so smooth, you're covered in felt. I'm covered in milk, champagne, and rose petals. Brick for brick with a house, no Lego. Jay's upstairs, I'm waiting. There's loads of free Domino's pizza that keeps getting taken to that floor. More Domino's pizza. Got me harming my dick turned metal. Bumper wobbling, wine up jello. Nice to meet you, slow tie, hello. Are you in a rave looking so nice? We can talk problems, night time to sun time. We can go beaches. Wow. Five minutes of the off at Scrabbles to get off rapid. Do you work for Lego? Oh, they're different floors. Three pizza upstairs if you. I don't know if you fancy. I don't work for Lego. I'm eating a load of pizza. We left alright. Come here. This way. Rock shot. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we just did a we did a booter from Lego HQ. <laughs> this is still stop. Stole their pizza and then bounced before the event started. Oh, really? uh, we're at the WeWork event tonight. Okay, just sign in, please. Zero waste documentary and panel session. Quick, okay. we just got here for the drinks. Let me just sign in for the event tonight. You've got to be secure. That's uh, so a co-working space. We just watched a plastic documentary. Um, I was actually really interested. I thought, what did you think, Zach? It was really good. We'll leave a we'll leave a link in the bio. That actually was pretty interesting. They had beer on tap, so that could have been several drinks. We left because it started getting um, a bit heated. Some woman started kicking off. Yeah. See ya. Oh, ow. Gone. Like we. Whoa, fucking hell, lad. look at that innovation. You've got your flashlight on your phone to do as like a flash for the GoPro. <laughs> so we left the documentary screen in feeling triumphant. We had drank around 11 free drinks each, ate a load of pizza, enjoyed a documentary and not spent a penny. But there was one more thing we wanted to do before calling it a day. I belong. Hey, hey, the karaoke when I want to sing the song. <laughs> Mama, I've been boozing all day. <laughs> Hi. Do we play Mama Mia? Well, yeah, the songs that we have. Mama Mia. Uh, Do you want to hire a room? It's 32 pounds for one hour. How about if we have it for 10 minutes and pay you 15 pounds? A minimum of one hour. Ten minutes, fifteen pounds. Yeah. Ten minutes, forty pounds. Free drink? Can we clean up some dishes or glasses yeah. for a free drink? Yeah.